there are different uh, players out there, you know, doing these uh, like custodial or like hybrid, you know, CD Fi uh, yield generation. So other than like the road tokens you're talking about, what other differentiators would you say is unique to Flurry? I think um, so. If you compare decentralized against centralized, I, I think um, th uh, this one is easy to answer because centralized. Um, uh, I mean, the you generation products, you you don't you, you never know like how they use your fund to generate your interest for you. Mm -hmm. So, if you believe in the uh, in the centralized one, then uh, it's okay. But then a lot of users may not uh, believe in uh, these centralized uh, you you products because. Um, I mean, for me, I, I won't put in the centralized you uh, you products because you never know how they generate the yield for you. So if they are offering you a high yield, I will be worried about uh, how they generate that yield. And if they are lending to some market makers or traders to trade, that means there is a high chance of um, uh, not able to get back your fund. So uh, I, I won't put in the centralized one. But then um, in other uh, decentralized products, our... Uh, differentiation is that uh, the, the thing we talk about with cross chain right now I think um, at the moment no no uh, products out there uh, are doing cross chain most of them are limited to a single chain uh, Ethereum uh, because this is still the biggest source of uh, yield and then the second feature is the rebasing mechanism that we talk about uh, in other yield products you cannot use your fund when you are earning interest but then in Flurry uh, because of the road token rebasing mechanism you can spend your road tokens right away so your fund is not locked up got you okay okay it seems like you really are you have everything really well planned so 